welcome everybody tonight. Thank you for coming to the uh, Ottawa County Fair and bringing all these little people to be in the baby show. Believe you me, they are hot. So we're hoping maybe, usually always it rains during the fair. And I said last night they had a little rain. But I'm going to do a little bragging because I live seven miles south of Minneapolis. And we had a little freak rainstorm last night, about an inch and a half of rain. So, I didn't have to water today. I just leisured all afternoon with a book. But anyway, normally I'm watering. We have all kinds of activities going on here at the fair. I didn't read my schedule so I came because I didn't realize I was going to be uh, freewheeling here. And I see they did have the dance team and the basketball deal. And Oh, somebody help me out. What else? Oh, a tractor pull tonight. There's all kinds of food. No end to the food, it looks like. Got some horses over here that are ready to do their thing. And of course, all the exhibits are up here that we want you to enjoy and take time to see. Because the forage kids and the other kids have done a good job of getting their things together and want you to come out and see what they've done. So take time to do that. I'm a real prompt person. So um, we might have these ladies in blue. Since they wouldn't give me a list of their names, we might have to have a parade. Oh, got that look. Guess we won't be having a parade of the ladies. Let's see. Are you guys helpers? Oh, wow. Tell me your name. Morgan. Morgan. What's your last name? Kelly. What uh, year in school are you? A freshman. Don't we wish we were a freshman again? And what year are you? Seventh yeah, grade. Oh. Age two, and I know that mom can appreciate that. So anyway, we appreciate you girls helping, and I assume that you have a grandma that's in the court or the SCE club. Yeah, you have a grandma that's in the SCE club. They just dragged you off the street. No. Okay. Okay. Somebody did ask me to help, so. Okay. Gretchen, what's going on down there? We don't have a list. Uh, the Rock City SCE agreed to do this after uh, Home Arts uh, did it for 13 years. And uh, we helped them last year, and then this year they're on their own. But we uh, decided that they needed a little help, so here we are. But we might not have been as much help as we should have been. So anyway, we forgot to tell them that it was hot in July. Maybe we should have. We wouldn't have done it. So anyway, we did a super job of decorating the stage. We got our red, white, and blue all kinds of pretty things. So, uh, yes, yes. Now they got tired of seeing me crawling up that trailer and then after I had my last birthday, they said, that's enough for her, we'll give her some steps. <laughs> so we do have steps.
ladies of blue and get his number. He is in the last group, so there's plenty of time, but if he can get his number, they would sure appreciate it.
Okay, we have Eli Leach, and he is 12 months, so he's just beginning to walk. His parents are Daniel and Delray Leach, Leach, and he lives in Salina. And on his pants, he has one of his bald builder. Good job, Eli. Oh, what a pretty smile. Such pretty blonde hair. Thank you. I might mention that we will, uh, after the boys are done, that we will we'll have a, uh, we'll have a girl winner and a boy winner, and then we'll have a picture. And that way they don't have to wait around so long. All right, now we have Tracy. Raglan. He's 13 months. Look how chunky these little boys are. Ooh, they're going to be easy. And his parents are Rochelle and Jeremy. And he lives in Minneapolis. And he's saying, there's Mom. He's got his little swim trunks on. Got his hands on his hips. He says, I'm not sure. Oh, here we go. We're just walking down the ramp there. Good job. Come and get the ball. There you go. Oh, what a pretty smile. Look at those big blue eyes and blonde hair. There you go. Very good, Grayson. You did a good job. Yeah, probably. Good. Girl, you might give us the water now. Okay, thank you for being in our baby show. You can take some. That's all. You know, I know the reason that that's so cute. Okay, after they get their tallies done, and we will decide who the winners are. We've always just done this for fun. There's no money involved. We just give them a small prize. And uh, I, I always did think that maybe it was just for the grandmas and grandmas. But it's so neat to see your kids perform. Sometimes they don't. Sometimes they do. The way you If I wasn't worried about him falling off of that horse, he could have got off the horse, too. So when do they do the picture? Okay. They'll announce the winners and they get the picture. Oh, okay. Is that the art teacher? Art teacher? I'm 
is Aubrey Kendall. She's 23 months, and Jenna and Chris Kendall are her parents. And they're from Dallas. She's a redhead. And we know how those redheads are. Sometimes they do it, sometimes they don't. But anyway, she's got a little polka dot suit on and some gold sandals. Oh, look, I know that lady. Very good. All right. Thank you, Aubrey. You did a good job. And I can tell you what, that red hair is going to get you in trouble all your life. Next, we have Lauren Pan. Her parents are Robert and Renee, and she's from Salina, I think. But she has a little yeah. black and white polka dots and a pretty little bow and dark hair. Oh, I like her shoes. Wish I had a pair like that. All right. And she's 20 months old. Thank you, Lauren, for being in our baby show. We have Arizona Leslie. Is that right? Leslie. All right, Misha and Chad are her parents. And she's two. Oh, oh, oh. she's two. <laughs> she lives in Minneapolis. She's got her a really sharp looking swimming suit on and curls. Oh, look at the curls. Well, you never know, something might be back there. Uh, not really. She's taking out, she's taking the back way out. Here she comes. Oh, I know that guy. She's got her blue bracelet on. She knows who that guy is. Oops. I'll try that again. This is how they do it on the runway, Mom. Okay. Thank you, Arizona, for being on, you know, baby show. Alright, next is Gracie Dreyer and Amanda and Jeff are her parents. And she's got a SpongeBob swimsuit. Oh cool. I like SpongeBob. Matter of fact, my husband told me when you watch SpongeBob, you're dumber than so anyway, she's got her little suit on, she's got her hair all done up. She's kind of looking at the girls, not sure what she's supposed to do, but she uh, is a great granddaughter of Nancy Lyon. Oh. And she lives in Salina. We're really happy that Gracie came out to be in our baby show. Such a pretty little blonde. Oh, look at those blue eyes. Good thing I'm not a judge. Anyway, we thank you, Gracie, for being in our baby show. You did a good job. Carrie 
and he's 21 months old. He brought, he brought his cowboy hat to the fair, and he's got on his fish swim trucks that have a little bit of orange. Uh, Tasha is his mother. Tasha, excuse me. Oh, and Kenny, oh, I forgot to put the dad on. But anyway, they live in Delphus. Cuter and a little bug. Got his shoes on there. I can tell he hasn't been in the sun a whole lot, but I don't blame him a bit. Thank you, Kyle. You did a good job. Love your hat. Sure, you can have one. Thank you for being in our show. Twenty-one months and lives in Minneapolis, and he had on a blue dinosaur swim trunks. Oh, I love those dinosaurs! All right, thank you, Peyton. And that is the end of the boys. So we will judge the boys and the girls, and then take their picture. You know, they used to always tell me to drag this out. I'm right up there on the park.
then they say women can't make up their mind. <laughs> there you go. Oh, he wants to sit there. Maybe they could share. There you go. Said I really look at the pretty lady. <laughs> oh, cute. Oh, so much for that. That probably is kind of an indication for you. There you go. Aren't they cute at that age? And then they go. <laughs> Oh, he says sand. Oh, we got our shoes off because there's sand. We need to play in that sand. That's a boy thing. All right. Thank you. We appreciate you. Oh, okay. We missed someone on the first picture. So we're going to take our picture now. She said it is way too hot and it's getting close to bedtime. She's got her favorite toy and her binkies. You can't ask her anything more. Cute. All right. Thank you. I'm glad we got her Thank you. Thanks for coming back. Okay. We are ready for the uh, 24 month or 36 months. So first we have Anna Lisa Murphy. And she lives in Bennington and she's 36 months old. And her mom is Ashley. And she's got the prettiest little pink cowboy. Oh, it's tractors! She's got tractors! And a cowboy boots that are pink. And pretty, pretty, pretty. Got a little barrettes in her hair. Oh, thank you. You did a good job. Very good. I like that John Deere dress. He says I can have it. It looks really cool. Much cooler than what I had on. All right, now we have Chloe Cannon. And Mom is Terry. And they live in Topeka. And Chloe is 35 months old. And she's got a little sundress on. I got her hair all done up. A purple dress and purple shoes. Pretty, 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 pretty. Very good job. You're a pretty girl. Thank you. Oh, when they're older, they're so sophisticated. There's blue and silver and red. Oh, wow. Thank you. Now we have Riley Ayers, and Mom is Ashley, and Grandma and Grandpa are Angie and Charlie Finkbinder, and she lives in Minneapolis, and she's 36 months old, and she has stars and stripes on her swimsuit, and her hair's in a little ponytail. Pretty, pretty girl. Aren't we fortunate? Oh, that goes with your swimsuit. Wow. Thank you, Riley. Kinley Jameson. That was one I had on my other sheet. <laughs> All right, Kinley's 27 months old, and her parents are Mandy and Donnie, and she lives in Delphus. And she's kind of thinking about maybe Let's see, who do you have on your shirt? Is it Minnie? Oh, that was a big leap. Wow. 
All right. Is Minnie on your swimming suit? Is that Minnie? Minnie and Mickey Mouse, and she's got red and white. She's a bouncer. Oh, wow. She's got ponytails. Pretty, pretty girl. Thank you. Kenna Collins, and she's 26 months, and McKinney's parents are Kelsey and Van. They live in Tesco. She has the prettiest pink and white polka dot suit, her little bow. There, I just need a little help, thank you. Here she comes. Got some red and white bows on her hair. Thank you, McKenna. You did a really nice job. Boyle and Corey and Casey are her parents and she's 34. She's waving at somebody over there. For God's sakes, wave at her. There you go. All right, her parents are Corey and Casey and she lives in Minneapolis. And, oh, she's all decked out in this pretty suit. Oh, silver shoes and purple barrettes. Very good. Did everybody wave at you? Okay. Thank you, Quindley. Okay, Keegan's over here practicing. And uh, this is Keegan Hart, Hardesty, and she's uh, 30 months. She belongs to Waylon and Krista. And there's a mini atlas. Oh, she sees somebody she knows. And she's got a purple suit on and a pretty bow. Wow. Oh, if I look that good in a swimming suit, honey, I'd wear one all day. Woo! That's a horse, isn't it? Silver on her shoes. Oh, that'll go with your shoes. Thank you, Keegan. All right, this is Rena and Zach. And I think that Grandma is Lucy outside here, not, not the parent. She's 32 months old, a little doll. Crocs on. Pretty girl with the blonde hair. Yes. That's the way to wait. Oh, you got it, Master. Good job. Thank you. Thank you, Rita. Good job. Help me out with the name. Amaya. Amaya Shar is 29 months old. And Lacey. Joe. Yeah, this, she's got a really pretty suit on. And some silver shoes. And the same color bow and a necklace and curly hair. Wow. Thank you.
Beauty. It has a blue and pink and green, a turquoise swimming suit, and a pink bow and pink shoes, and a pretty smile, pretty hair. Thank you, Molly. You did a good job. You need to wave at her? Okay. There you go.
says it's over already. All right. Thank you, Grayson. She said, shoot, I could do this again. I did so good. And I won't lose you. Thank you, thank 
thank you, thank you, thank you. Now next year they're going to really know what's going on. What? What? I just get paid for an hour and it's 8 o'clock. Gotta hurry this on. Chris can know I'm kidding. <laughs> now they're telling me they hope it's a lot of pay. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've done this for 14 years for no pay. It's so called pay. It's fun to do it, it's fun to see the kids. Appreciate the parents and the grandparents that come out participate. The, the one mistake I did make this year was I should have had one of the Rock City FCE take turns with me and one do one child and me do the next child. Didn't happen. The uh, girls is Anna Lisa Murphy, and for the boys, oh, wouldn't you know it's his name? I can't pronounce. Oh, Gravian, <laughs> thank you. Gravian uh, Welch got first prize. So they get their picture taken uh, for the Minneapolis Messenger. We would like to send it to the New York Times, but they don't want us anymore. Wow, you're a 